I started um, messing about with school and that, so I was pretty destructive at school, but I was in with a good set of friends. And then I met a different set, which were into crime, all the drugs and all that, and I ended up going with them. So yeah, that led to the life of petty crime, recreational drug use, daft little things getting in trouble. And I've faced, I've faced some struggles, some, some hard, hardships in the time. I've, I've been to prison, I've been to some, to some tough prisons, faced some tough situations, you know, been in been some situations that I should never put myself in, but it was, um, my mum found someone in the house that shouldn't have been there. And it was basically like an intervention with my, si her and my sister, just both in floods of tears. You need to change, you need, you, you need to get help, son. You, you can't keep on doing this. But I couldn't see the damage I was doing, because you're selfish. You're selfish in that, aren't you? So you couldn't see the destruction I was doing to my family. It was seeing the despair in their eyes that, listen, we don't know what, we don't know what else to do. She, she said, there's help on there if you want it, son, so come down and see Brian, we can get your way to rehab. I mean, what, whatever, whatever I want, whatever I need, it's, it's, it's there, the support from Brian and Stella and the whole organisation as a whole, it's there. I think a lot of people think they just send you off to rehab and that's it. It's, it's not that, you know, the, the, the care after you while you're there, when you come home, the, the support, if, what can we do, what can we put you into place? There's, there's a lot of support still ongoing that I appreciate to this day. Really, I know my callings to help other people stuck in addiction, stuck in that life. For the miracles I've seen, it'd be a shame for me not to try and help other people. So that, 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 that's my aspirations, I believe. I've got, I've got inner peace that I've ne never felt before in my life, you know. C certain struggles come up and I just, I trust in God and I just realise that he's got my back. So yeah, I'm, I'm happy and I'm, I'm optimistic with what the, what the future's got on hold for me.